Hey there folks and welcome back for my round 4 of the Philadelphia Autumn Regionals. My opponent in this match is Richard M. Now my record right now is 2-1 uh, and one, and I'm hoping to make that 3-1 and one and stay in the running for top 16 or whatnot. Um, I was thinking that he, he had the... Um, he had the Polytoe, so I was thinking he was probably running a rain team, and so I brought my Abomasnow, and it turns out that both Pokemon that Abomasnow would have been really helpful against, namely his um, Polytoe and his Dragonite, are who he didn't bring, so that kind of sucks. Uh, and so here, his Her Heracross must be Scarfed, goes for that Rock Slide, gets a crit on my Rotom, and the Flinch, which really, really sucked, um, but <laughs> yeah, now I get the useless burn on him, Lungus. Um, that... I also don't take out either of his Pokemon with Heat Wave. They're surprisingly bulky, gotta say. Um, here I go for the Discharge, take out Heracross, thank god. Uh, Among Us, though, is going to take out my Rotom with a Giga Drain. Um, if only I hadn't gotten... Actually, I don't know what I would have done. Um, well, I guess... Oh, right, okay, so if I hadn't um, gotten flinched on that previous turn, I could have taken out Heracross round one. But anyway, he goes for Protect on Among Us. I have Mamoswine go for Ice Shard, and then Tornadoes go for Air Slash. It misses! Uh, not that it really would have mattered too much. My loading is pretty bulky, unless I'd gotten the lucky flinch, but, you know, then I'm just saying, oh, I wish I'd had hacks instead of he'd had hacks. So here I'm going to go ahead and take out his Among Us. Um, but he's got that light screen up, and the... Um, and he's, I've got mostly special attackers left, so uh, he's going to go ahead and Scald my Mamoswine, get down to really low HP, and his last Pokemon is uh, Metagross, which is really not good for me. Mamoswine is now going to go down to a Bullet Punch. I was really hoping that maybe he was slow and wouldn't run and I could go for Earthquake, but no such luck. Um, thanks to that light screen, um, Heat Wave is doing nothing, and Tornadus is going to go down to an Ice Beam, and now I'm down to a single Pokemon, which is weak to ice or not uh, to um, steel type attacks, and this game is basically over. Um, I'm doing some protect stalling. Uh, yeah, I'm considering most of my attacks are special. Also, I'm kind of hoping that the light screen fades away. So here, I go ahead. I actually take that uh, bullet punch better than I thought I would. Uh, and Scalds aren't going to do anything. So here I'm going to go for a Giga Drain, and it does nothing thanks to the fact that Light Screen is up. So, uh, I mean, I'm just going to stall him out, hope that the Light Screen ends, and that I can, you know, maybe take down one of his, one more of his Pokemon, but I've got nothing for that Metagross. So at this point, I'm kind of just being a dick with all the Protect stalling. But um, there there is something to that strategy. I think if it, if it had gone down to the timeout, I still would have lost, basically, based on the fact... I don't know how it's calculated, I think it has to do with how much HP the remaining Pokemon have, and that Metagross is going to have more HP than me. So I get a crit here, a very lucky crit to take out his Milotic. Um, uh, in my opinion, that made up for some earlier hacks, but your mileage may vary. I go ahead and protect here, no particular reason. I know that the next Bullet Punch is going to take me out. At this point, I kind of wish I had leftovers rather than... Um, the Akaberry, but oh well, Obama Snow is taken out, and I am now, I've gone from having a 2-0 record to a 2-2 two two record, so that kind of blows.